All right, guys, here we're talking about Season 5, Episode 13 of The Twilight Zone. All right, what do you think about this episode? Episode sucked. Thanks for joining us. Talk to us next week. Bye. I got, I, uh, it's not, Did you like it? It's not a super memorable episode for me. Okay. Um, you want to start us off in the beginning? Uh, there's a lady. She's like an actress or some famous ring lady or something the like that. The ring a gal or... I don't know what that means, but she says, I have a picture deal and whatever. Yeah. Me and Yul Brenner are coming, these, I don't know. These kind of episodes. So it, it is a lady. <laughs> she is famous in, in, in the motion picture industry, as, as you've stated. And uh, she wants to go visit her, her old town because they just sent her a ring that had magical powers or something that yes, is compelling so her to go back. She rece- I was going to keep going. She yeah. receives a magic ring that has little people in it telling her to do stuff. Yeah. And she goes back to her hometown. At some point, we start cutting to her being on the plane, though, and it becomes very apparent what type of weird. I don't. These are my least favorite kind of episodes where I'm like, wait a minute, what? <laughs> because you can't have it any other way. It's like, well, everyone saw her. She was there. It's not yeah. like it's, it was a ghost. And then the way that guy calls, then the you know, I've so, seen spoiler, her body. The, the, yeah, the plane, the plane crashes. Uh, into the town where they're having a picnic that her showing up diverted by having them see her one-man play at and, the... Uh, and the people in the ring are like, save us! It's only you who can help yeah. us! You're my only hope! Oh, people. It's this stupid thing. And, like, so, it, like, it's weird to, to say this because of how time works, but, like, they were trying to do, like, a Donnie Darko thing almost or something like that. Yeah. Which is weird because Donnie Darko came out 40 years, 50 years later. But that's what I'm saying. It was some weird thing where it's like, oh, and then you go, like, wait a minute. No, it doesn't matter what you're talking yeah. about. Yeah. You're your like, own grandpa. Like oh, some yes. Shit. But, like... Imagine I, if I hadn't have told you about the Vaz, if you'd have still knocked it over, you see. No, but that, that's not even like it I don't like anything either, where you're no. like, well, well what, what do you mean? Like, obviously she was there. She left her ring, which was, like, broken, like, at the time. Yeah, they had, they had to add the little, like, she picks up the ring. Like, maybe she was here. And I'm like, you've been talking to her for, like, two days. What do you yeah. mean? Maybe, maybe I am wrong. Like, that's so weird. The only way to make this work is, like, in a movie or something. But even then, you have to show her, like, on the plane, like, passed out or something like that. Like, and, like, like in her dream and, she's like, there? And, like, make us think it's a flashback. You have to do some weird thing where it turns out to a... Right? You have to cinch it up at the... La- you have to shine on it at and the very would, end. And that would only work to confuse you for a little while. At the yes. end, you'd still be like, what? Doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Uh, and and uh, yes, it's a Twilight Zone, but most of the things are like like, oh, did that really happen? Oh, it was a ghost. Blah, blah. This one, I'm like, no. Well, you spelled there's... it out in every way that I'm like, that that did happen. She had this the, for whatever so, reason. Like... This ring enabled her to know things were gonna happen. Um, no, but like that's the whole thing. Is like the plane you... happened across over, like, and, you, and like... it was foreshadowed so heavily that you gotta look out the window and see right into the town I came from. Like yes, it's right. We fly right over it. In fact. Yeah. Oh, there's a storm. They play like weird lightning every now and then. The whole thing is bad. The only way this could possibly work is if it was somehow a thing where like, like, it's like, no, like she doesn't even get the ring. Like, like, is the ring even real? Who sent her the ring? Is the, like, like the Twilight Zone works when, when, when there's a character who's like, he believed enough and he made the mannequin uh-huh. real or some weird thing where you're like, maybe if the coin lands on its edge, maybe you could land on your edge, but like with powers, like yeah. there has to be some dumb connection. Whereas here, there was no setup to make me feel like she was thinking about her hometown or like something no. weird she wasn't like afraid of flying like there was no weird angle the where biggest I could... issue i have for this episode is that a storm a lightning storm rain or whatever it is is what brought down the plane Tore that would, stuff. that would stop a picnic in its tracks i know they'd be like oh lightning uh-huh called off I had the same and thought. you'd be fine yeah i had so the same to thought. use that as the reason it crashes just seemed lazy where i'm like wait a minute are we not thinking here <laughs> No, very why, much so. Like, why would this... I have that later on in my thing, which I didn't even think we were even going to need. But yes, like... Yeah. She's like, don't go to the picnic during the giant thunderstorm. <laughs> Instead, go here. Yeah. Yeah. You have to wear your... Here, wear my famous shawl thing because it's so, you know, like, blustery out. I... Like, I think that there's something there with her seeing certain people and then needing to talk to them for other reasons or whatever. But again, like, that has to be part of a different structure that would work properly. Otherwise, it's just like nothing. No, that that didn't do it for me. And at the end, there's no, like, aha, because maybe in the Twilight, like, there's no stupid... Rod Serling sometimes can save it for me where he's like, "But, but, but maybe one day look to the skies and you could see your own version of this. And I'm like, no, there's nothing here that makes no. a thing. Maybe if they would have played it at the end where she didn't find the ring, she didn't do anything, and the sister was like, like talking to someone and like, but I just saw my sister. What do you mean? And right. no one else saw her? Yes. And but they then were it would just be like, like, well, how did she stop the thing? Like, 
the thing yeah, that would she, make it good still goes, wouldn't work. She goes on television yeah. or whatever, right? So again, like, so for, like for that potentially ending... Potentially it's recorded. <laughs> yes, so like for that ending, you would have to have the guy just talking to no one or telling you himself to go see her. You'd have yeah, to, it would like, be the, like, the end of in Blair Witch of the, 2 <laughs> where it would show you what really happened. Yes, I love the end of Blair Witch 2. I do too. Yeah, the problem is the, the beginning and the middle of Blair Witch 2. The end, great. And it has the guy from... Uh, what is that one called? Like, I've been fired from the FBI or whatever it's called. Burn that. Burn <laughs> <laughs> Stop or my mom will fire me from the FBI or yeah. something. <laughs> yes. No, I, like, this is not even a top, like, I don't know. I can't even say there, there's one good shot in this episode mm -hmm. when she's, like, realizing that she's fake or something. And it does, like, kind of like an almost handheld, like, zoom, on, you, know, you okay. know, in on her or something. And it plays some music or the things change. Um, Twilight Zone can be very locked down with its camera work. Yes. So I always notice when something's like I think in general that was a thing of the 60s. It was a yes. lot of lockdown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not like Twilight Zone like specifically. Mm -hmm. but So that kind of piqued my thing. But yeah, when you get, and she fades out. She goes out in the rain yeah. and like disappears and stuff. Yeah, everything is bad about this, I think. Yeah. All right, guys. Zero, zero out of 20? What are we saying here? I, yeah, okay. not a fan. Bottom, bottom of the barrel Twilight Zone episode for me. Uh, that was our thoughts on this episode, guys. Let us know in the comments what you thought about it. Don't die in a fire, and we'll see you next time. Hello, Internets. I just love watching Just Taggers. If you've enjoyed this video as much as I have, click that subscribe button. <laughs> Peace out, homies.